Having one-on-one -on -one meetings can get boring really quick, especially during COVID that everybody needs to stay at home. Online meetings has become a necessity. But you can make it a little bit more fun and engaging by using Mesh to interact with your friends, with your family, and with your colleagues as well. So let us show you how you can do that. Soon as you are in your Mesh dashboard, you have two places where you can go to. For, so the first thing you will have is a private space that never changing. So you have your own private space. In this case, it's app.mesh.online slash pitchground. If you press edit, you will see that you will have a few options to choose from. So the house party, the art gala, and the workplace for a map wise. So you also have these NSFW. So turning on this option will add questions and dares that are not suitable for work to the mini games. So if you want to hang out with friends and do that inside your, your personal private mesh space, you can also turn this on. You can also leave, turn it off if you want to use this space for meetings or hang out with your colleagues. Soon as you have uh, created your changes or did your changes, you can just press save. And then it will load, as you can see here, it will refresh the page and the page will load. And this takes a couple of seconds and then the changes have been made. And you can just go inside of the space, hang out with your colleagues, hang out with your friends. But you can also do something really different with Mesh. What you can also do is create events. And events are temporary spaces, temporary links that you will generate and that can be all sort of events. For example, having a reunion with your college friends, right? You can just go to my events and then I already started the room, but you can also already go with start a mesh and that will set up a room for you. So if I say start a mesh, you can again select from a three different maps and you can also schedule the event. So if you want to schedule it for this weekend, for example, you can just go to later and you can just go to the desired date. So for example, if I want to do this on Sunday, I could say something like, I want to go live at 1 p.m. And also not, uh, not to forget, you can also select your own time zone. And as you can see, my events, I created a few uh, in the last few days to test things out. But this is the link you can invite your friends to. So share this link with your friends. So you can just copy this, send them over to Messenger, and send them inside of an email. Everybody can just join in. So how does this look like uh, on a logged out account? So let's sign out and let's go to this link. There we go. So you need to allow your microphone and camera to be used. And now you will see my camera. And you can also select your microphone. Uh, but from here you can give yourself a name so for example just mark and you can create your avatar so you can go with a body so let's just do this one let's create one real quick uh, let's do this hair you can have a different hair color you can also have a different outfit so there are all kinds as you can see and i'm pretty confident that there are going to be more uh, items to choose from later on. You can go with hairstyle and just put on a sleeping cap or an astronaut helmet if, if you want to and then go with an item. So you can have a coffee mug, a bottle or it seems a loaf of bread and then enter this mesh. From here the uh, the element is loaded so the page is being loaded and you're now inside your own a space so everybody who has the link can join this space so how cool is this you can interact with your friends family you can even hang out with your colleagues just inside of this space so you can go pretty much anywhere you want to by just clicking so soon as your avatar comes close to others then the cameras will pop up and you can interact with them. So you can have a one-on-one uh, -on -one conversation 
like with a Zoom or like with a Google Meet, but you have this fun environment where you can interact with each other, which is pretty cool because as a host, you can also set up a radio station. You can uh, listen to music. You can do all sort of things. So it's really, really fun and a completely new different setting to engage with family, to uh, interact with friends, but also colleagues. So Mesh can be used to spice up your interaction with your friends, with your family, with your colleagues by using an interactive environment, a digital 8-bit environment that brings you back a little bit more in the arcade mode, but with fun games and fun interaction to hang out with each other. So try out Mesh and let us know how you find it.